All right, so we're going to talk some more about um, commands and reporters and inputs and outputs and how you can use that to um, track down errors. So the last time we said um, if you had like FD home in here and said reset, it's going to be a problem. And even though it did what we wanted, we don't want to have error messages coming up to confuse our users. So we want to eliminate all kinds of error messages coming up. So that fixes it. And then, um, so let's try another one. Let's say we want to, let's say we put in a, a fill color in the background here. Fill it with that bucket. And we want to, um, we're going to, you know, I'm, I'll just call it add stuff. We're going to randomly add together the X core and let's say we want the, fill, the color from the background that we filled in there. So I'm going to say to add stuff, I type in add stuff. Whoa, what happened? Phil didn't report anything to sum in add stuff and then yikes, it filled up the whole background. So we've seen this before, right? If something didn't report anything, that means that something is um, a, a, a what? A command, right? So sum, sum actually needs, if we say sum by itself, it says need more inputs. But if we just said sum x core, it still needs more inputs. So sum is still looking for inputs. After, after we've found x core, some because some needs two inputs so some is still looking for inputs when it comes to fill and what well, let's fill okay let's look that one up fill and where'd our turtle go fill fills a clo closed area with the turtle's pen color oh okay so um so fill makes a change in the world right in micro world so it's a command so commands don't report anything that's why when we said add stuff it said fill didn't report anything to sum in add stuff so let's fill it with green again and there's our turtle okay we couldn't see the turtle before because the background was the same color as the turtle so how do we get the um, background color? There's, a, there's something called BG. Let's look it up. BG in the vocabulary, BG. What's it say? Stands for background, reports a number. And how do you find these things if you, um, if you don't know the names already? Um, like I knew I wanted BG, so I looked up under B. But there's all these, also all these sections in here with different topics. So if you look under turtles and graphics, then you don't have like the whole vocabulary list to look through. It, it's a it's a smaller set of um, you know of procedure names that you need to look to, and um, you know so then it's easier to find. So uh, okay, BG is what I want. It reports a number representing the color of the background. That's what I was looking for. Okay, so that's what I'm going to use. Oh, you know what I forgot to mention before, too, is this. See where it says primitive right here in this heading? Um, well, actually, we did kind of say a primitive or a primitive procedure. That's just, you know, the, the name of a procedure. So in this column, you have the primitive, and then if it has any inputs, It'll have the input or inputs that, that go with the primitive. And then there's the description and the examples. But anyway, back to BG. BG stands for background, reports a number representing the color of the background. And they show some examples in here too. Okay. Oh, this looks like a fun one to try. This would be a good one to try out sometime. Report 100, repeat 140 times, set BG to BG plus one. But anyhow, BG is our reporter. So now we have some, we have a reporter and another reporter. So let's try that one now. So now we should, everything should be happy, right? Some's getting 
um, the sum needs two numbers and it's getting the numbers it needs. So let's do add stuff. Whoa, what's going on here? I don't know what to do with minus 115 and add stuff. What's going on? Some should be happy, right? It's got what it wants. So, well, let's see. It's saying, I don't know what to do with 115. So it's not saying anything about, um, so before it was saying, Phil didn't report anything to some. It's not saying anything like that anymore. It's saying, let's, let's get rid of this extra junk here. So before, when we, when we, when we had a command here, this, when this said fill, we got, we got this error message. Phil didn't report anything to sum and add stuff. But now we have a, we have a reporter here. So we have a reporter. Sum needs two inputs. We have a reporter here and a reporter here. So sum should be happy, right? Now when we say add stuff, it says, I don't know what to do with minus 115 and add stuff. So where did that come from? Well, now it's not saying anything about anything being reported to sum. Let's look up sum. Vocab, and it says, let's see, sum, 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 sum. Oh, there's a lot of S words. Because set, look at uh, most of them start with set, it looks like. You can set a lot of things. All right, so. Stop, stop all, stop me. Sum. Reports, uh-oh, reports the sum of its inputs. Sum is a reporter. So even though sum has, has inputs, it also has output. It's also a reporter. So once it's collected all its inputs, it reports it reported this number 115 and Fu doesn't know what it's supposed to do with 115 so let's 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 make it I don't know let's make it go uh, right by that amount so maybe we should go uh, turn I don't know we'll just call it a turn we'll just call it turn and let me see, see here. right because add stuff doesn't really make so much sense now because now what we're doing is we're saying okay find the sum of the of the x core and the background and the number that represents the background color okay so sum those two together and then that's the that's the amount of turn we're going to do we're going to turn right by that amount so let's try that let's say turn oops turn Ah, now we can do something. Now we're happy. Okay, so really important. Um, um, you know, uh, what am I going to say? Reporters can some reporters sometimes need input. Okay, but you can and you can still get that. So you can still get that. Uh, I don't know what to do with error if you don't. Um, if you if you if you once your reporter has got all its inputs, so you always need to check to see. Wait, am I using? Am I trying to like start my instruction with a with a reporter? If the first thing in your line of instruction is a reporter, you're going to have trouble. It's going to say, I don't know what to do with. Okay, so for a reporter. If, if the reporter needs inputs, you need to give it all of its inputs. But you also need to make sure that if it outputs something, that you're, you're outputting to um, some, some uh, command eventually, right? 